Hi. Excuse the hair. Been working all day. On and off all day. Um, I'm going to show you guys what I've been up to. So, y'all know that I've moved again and I'm with my mom. And we had a shed in the back. Y'all didn't know that, but I'm telling you. We have a shed in the back. And I'm turning this into my craft room. But for now, I've had a lot of cleaning and things that needed to be done. So I'm going to flip the camera around because, I don't know why. Anyway, I'm going to turn the camera around so you guys can see what I'm doing right now. Why I'm kind of not making any videos at the moment, but I will be. So. It doesn't look like much right now. It looks like a lot of work right now. But, this right here. So I'm going through and I'm organizing and I'm cleaning. And this used to be my grandfather's work, little workshop shed on the back of the pot house. And the hurricane, this was metal roofing. But the hurricane had messed it up. So my mother had new boards put up and... This plastic roofing stuff, which will give me really good daylight. See, the light's pretty good in here. So once I get all this cleaned up and everything, see, then this will be my workspace. And then I get some electric run out here. And then eventually, I'm going to put some insulation and drywall. So then it'll be all drywalled. And then all this stuff will be organized and... So this is craft room slash storage area at the moment. This is where a lot of my stuff is stored. And, um, well, some of my stuff. I still got a lot of stuff I have to get over here. But, anyway, so this is what I'm doing. So all this has got to be cleaned. And all this is what I've been working on today. Because this was piled with junk and garbage. And, see... These things that my grandfather stored his stuff in. Because like I said, this was his works bench. This is where he did all his little... When he built something or he repaired something. Or, you know, that's where it was. That's where he kept all that stuff. So, that's what I'm doing. That's what I'm in the process of doing. You know, I've got to get all my stuff organized. And then eventually, I'll have it weatherized, I'll have drywall in here, and you notice the lighting is a lot better than like in the house. Oh my god, my hair. <laughs> I need to just shave my head. Anyway, um, the lighting is just really good in here. So, and eventually I'll have electric out here again. There was electric once upon a time out here. But we'll have to run it again. We'll have to get electric out here. And um, that way I can have an air conditioner and fans. And super cold days some heaters. So that way I can deal with the temperatures. I don't think in the winter I'm going to need too much of a heater though. Because this stuff is the stuff that's used on greenhouses. Let me tell you. Working in here today I've been sweating my butt off. So. And I know it doesn't look like much right now, but this is going to be my craft room. And I think it's going to be plenty big enough for me. Once I get all this cleared away and everything taken care of, somewhere where I can just come out here and fiddle-faddle and do my thing. I'll have my Keurig. I'll have a little drink station set up with my Keurig. So I don't have to traipse in and out of the house. And, um, Yeah. And me and my brother do some stuff together, too. I think he's going to cut me some wood slices from some trees he's cut. So that I can make cool things. And not just little wood slices. They're going to be big ones, I think. He's going to do that for me. I don't know. I do know if that's happening or not. But, yeah, he's been... See, so there's the old wood from the roof and the old metal. So this is what we're doing. He's cleaning up the yard, cutting down trees, and 
picking up burning and we're just trying to get it under control and functioning livable so all right guys just wanted you to know what i've been up to hope you're having a great day stay tuned go ahead hit like subscribe notify notifications because hope crush your fingers say your prayers i've got big things coming for 2020 we of course have chalk couture we'll be doing and then some Brutus Monroe stuff. We know that I love my Brutus Monroe product. And yeah, let's say our prayers and hope things are going to go our way this year. Okay, have a great day. God bless. Love y'all. Bye.